హలో కిడ్స్ శుభమంగళం ఎథ్లెటిక్ స్కాలర్ హై స్కూల్ మై సెల్ఫ్ మిస్సెస్ నజీనా టేకింగ్ స్టాండర్డ్ టు సబ్జెక్ట్ సైన్స్ స్టాండర్డ్ టు సబ్జెక్ట్ సైన్స్ వీ హ్యావ్ కంప్లీటెడ్ విత్ ఫోర్ లెసన్స్ ఎస్ చిల్డ్రన్ టుడే వీ విల్ స్టార్ట్ న్యూ లెసన్ లెసన్ నంబర్ ఫైవ్ ఎస్ ఫోర్ లెసన్స్ వీ హ్యావ్ కంప్లీటెడ్ మై నీడ్ ఫుడ్ ఎస్ మై నీడ్ వాటర్ ఎస్ యాజ్ ఫుడ్ ఈజ్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ వాటర్ ఈజ్ ఆల్సో ఇంపార్టెంట్ అండ్ ఆల్సో వన్ మోర్ థింగ్ మై నీడ్ షెల్టర్ వాట్ ఈస్ షెల్టర్ హౌస్ ఈజ్ అవర్ షెల్టర్ వేర్ వీ ఆర్ లివింగ్ దట్ ఈజ్ అవర్ షెల్టర్ ఎస్ వేర్ వీ ఆర్ లివింగ్ కంఫర్టబుల్లీ సేఫ్లీ దట్ ఈజ్ అవర్ షెల్టర్ సో హౌస్ ఈజ్ అవర్ షెల్టర్ హౌస్ ఈజ్ అవర్ షెల్టర్ వీ ఫీల్ కంఫర్టబుల్ ఎస్ వీ ఫీల్ హ్యాపీ ఇన్ అవర్ హౌస్ ఎస్ బికాస్ వీ క్యాన్ డూ వాట్ ఎవర్ వీ వాంట్ ఇన్ అవర్ హౌస్ ఎస్ సో టుడే వీ విల్ లర్న్ మై నీడ్ షెల్టర్ యాజ్ ఫుడ్ ఈజ్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ యాజ్ వాటర్ ఈజ్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ we need shelter also shelter is also important for us yes in today's lesson we learn about shelter means house different types of houses yes and in which places we will find which type of house so in this lesson we will learn different types of houses and also today i will 1 to 23 new terms we will learn okay some more new terms are there i will give it in the next class yes children some more new terms are there that we will continue in the next class now in today 1 to 23 new terms i will explain each and every new term listen carefully yes when these new terms comes in lesson reading when i am teaching lesson at that time you should be able to give the answer so if you listen now carefully new terms explanation you can understand your lesson easily okay come on first one my need shelter s h e l t e r shelter what is shelter house is our shelter house is our shelter m a t e r i a l s materials material means things for constructing a house what materials are used what things are used like bricks are used cement is used sand is used steel is used yes for making a house we need all this without this we can't build our house without bricks you can build house no without steel rods you can build house no so material means the things which are needed now what i need to write on the board yes i need a marker yes marker is also a thing which i need to write on the board so to complete one thing what things we need that are that is known as material so here to make a house we need many materials like we need bricks we need uh, rods for putting pillars we will put rods no first we will put rods and on that we will put cement bricks sand all these are materials needed to build a house next protects protects means house is protecting you yes how house is protecting you when it rains you will not go out you will sit inside the house yes why if you go out you will get wet inside the house you will get wet no the house is protecting you and also when it is very hot also sweaty sweaty when the sun is shining brightly you will go out and play no you will sit at home you will sit at home and relax yes so house is protecting us house is protecting us from heat cold yes nowadays it's very cold no you will wear sweater and sit warmly inside the house you won't go out at night time why it is very cool outside so house will protect us from heat cold rain and also from thieves and also from here see t h i e v e s thieves who are thieves people who come and steal things from our house yes people who come and steal things from our house at night time before we go to sleep bed what we will do we will lock all our doors we will lock all our doors why we are locking because nobody should come and see steal our things we have many things at home we have laptops we have mobiles we have fridge we have tv we have mixers yes many valuable important things are there in house if we keep open our doors and sleep somebody will come and steal our things somebody will come and steal our things so what we will do before we go to bed before we go to sleep your parents will lock all the doors so that no thief should enter our house and steal the things so house is protecting us from eat 
cold rain and also from thieves and also from thieves many things we are not in house we are there and also whatever things we purchase also are in our house yes if thief come he may do some harm to us he may take our things so house is protecting us house is protecting us from thieves also b r i c k s bricks bricks are what the things which we use to make house yes where construction is going on you can see in one place they will keep bricks in one place they will keep put cement no cement bags in one place sand will be kept and in one place rods will be kept yes you saw bricks yes you all know bricks it will be in rectangular shape and how it will be hard how it will be very strong and hard C E M E N T cement. C E M E N T cement. Cement is like a powder. No, they will mix water in that, and it is used for plastering and constructing the house. P U C C A pakka. H O U S E house. Pakka house. Say me, what is a pakka house? Pakka house is a house made of brick, cement, steel. Okay, if a house is made of this bricks, cement, steel, how it will be? it is a pakka house it is very strong pakka house means it is strong house it is a strong building yes pakka houses are made of bricks cement steel if we construct now we where we are living we are living in pakka houses only yes we are living in pakka houses only if rain comes nothing will happen to us if uh, sun shines brightly nothing will happen to us yes if it is very cool outside also nothing will happen to us why because of this pakka house because of this pakka house pakka houses are very strong if rain comes anything happens to your house no nothing on the roads you can see all the trees uprooted falling down but for pakka house nothing will happen v i l l a g e s villages v i l l a g e s villages now say me where we are living we are living in city we are living in city village means interior places yes you will say no when we ask where you went sit teacher i went to village that means far away place from city m u d mud s t r a w straw straw means sticks children straw means sticks like bamboo sticks we have uh, on trees we can find sticks no wooden sticks is more mud Houses made of some houses are also made of mud and straw. Mud and straw. Pakka house is made of brick, cement, steel. Okay, it is very strong. Nothing will happen to our house. But some houses are made of mud. You all know mud. You will play with mud. Yes, sometime when you go to beach side, you will play with mud. Yes, mud. Straw means. sticks so some houses in village places if when you go to village side or when you pass on through village sitting in bus or car you can see houses made of mud and straw yes houses made of mud and straw they are strong no they are weak houses they are weak houses k u t c h a kacha h o u s e house yes houses made of mud and straw or kacha houses they are not pakka pakka means strong house kacha means weak house like huts like huts hut is not made of cement for hut is not made of bricks they use only mud straws sticks they use leaves sometimes to cover on top they will use leaves also suddenly if rain comes a big strong comes big strong means when air blows very hard what will happen the top of that kacha house will move yes so kacha houses are not strong because they are made of mud straw leaves straw means sticks p e r m a n e n t permanent p e r m a n e n t permanent means in one place pakka house it is a permanent house yes we can move it no it is very strong we can't move that pakka house but kacha houses how they are they are made of mud straw no after one year or two years what will happen if rain comes or big storm comes all the leaves will fall down all the sticks will fall down mud will melt mud will melt so it is not a permanent house pakka house is a permanent house it will stay in one place c i t i e s cities t o w n s towns what are cities and towns 
cities and towns are places where we are living we are living in cities and towns we are living in cities and towns c o t t a g e s cottages cottage means is a one type of house is a one type of house okay it is a single individual house single individual house b u n g a l o w s bungalows you can see big big bungalows no yes when you are moving in cities no we can see big big bungalows how it will be it is a independent house bungalow is a independent house in that house only one or two families their family members only living together it is a independent house m u l t i multi m u l t i multi s t o r e y e d storied multi story building means in that many families live multi story building means in that very many families live like apartment yes in apartment or if we are living in apartment only your family is living no you have many families living together in one building many families living together in one building yes all have their own house they all have then you have your own house in that apartment your neighbor have their own house in the apartment so multi story means many families living in one building t e m p o r a r y temporary means not permanent permanent house means they are in one place like pakka house will be in one place only temporary means not strong house they are kacha houses they can move temporary means for some time you can see those who come to construct houses no they will put a tent and stay for some days till the building is constructed they will stay in that house yes after that once the house construction is completed what they will do they will move from that place they will move they will pack all their luggages what they brought along with them and they will move from that place yes they are they won't stay permanently in that house they are temporary moving from one place to another c a n v a s canvas canvas means houses made of tent houses made of tent you will wear canvas shoes yes white shoes you will wear no children canvas shoes how it will be yes like your t-shirt no its cloth will be very thick fat canvas shoes you will wear yes how is the cloth of the canvas shoes for one year old one year you will use that shoes yes it won't tear yes why because the cloth is nice thick fat so canvas are tents canvas are tents made of canvas cloth who will use that tents soldiers will use tents you saw in army areas when you are moving you can see green color tents they are made of canvas cloth means thick cloth s o l d i e r s soldiers c a r a v a n caravan caravan means house on wheels you saw house on wheels yes some houses like now we have van in that van only they will remove all the seats and they will arrange it as a kitchen washroom everything will be there in that van yes so that they can move from one place to another they can move from one place to another on road sides we can see tiffin centers some people keeping tiffin tents on vans no yes those are idli whatever we have want to eat we will go and eat so how it will be after completing their work they will move from that place they will move from that place so car caravans are house on wheels in the same way we have houses also like van yes we have bedroom in that we have washroom in that we will be having whatever we want we can keep in that house so they these are these people they move from one place to another they will take their home along with them now if you are living in rent house you are going shifting to other house you will take this house along with you no because it is a permanent house it will be in one place only but this caravans are house on wheels wheels means for this house we will have wheels we will have you all know wheels yes for bus we have wheels for your cycle you have wheels so when they are these houses are made on wheels wherever they want to move they will take their house along with them and move because this house is made on wheels only house boats 
H O U S E house B O A T S boats what are house boats house boats we can see in uh, lakes yes where we can see mostly these house boats we can see in kerala we can see in kashmir yes you can see in when you are watching cartoon also we can see house boats ni in kerala we can see in kashmir we can see how it will be house will be in water yes it is made on boat where boat will be boat will be in water so uh, in that boat only they will make it as a home okay in that we will can relax we can sit yes so this uh, what is house boat house boat we can see in water it will be not on road it will be in water moving from one place to another in that house boat you can sit and you can visit the places we can visit the places in that water sitting in in the house boat it will be in water i g l o o s igloos means houses made of snow igloo means houses made of snow where we can find snow where in places where it is very cold very cold places we can find igloos houses made of snow igloo is a house made of ice s l o p i n g sloping say s l o p i n g sloping r o o f s roofs sloping first say me what is a roof top of your house you have top of your house yes that is our roof that is our roof without roof if roof is not there what will happen if roof is not there uh, you will get sunshine when rain comes also it will come inside our house roof is protecting us yes roof is protecting us so your sloping roof how sloping roof will be this is house children yes sloping roof means it will be like this slanting sloping means slanting yes because why they have in some places we have sloping roofs why when snow falls when rain comes it will slide down it will slide down it will slope down in some in places where it is snow falls snow fall is more in that places they use sloping roofs roof will be like this why when snow falls Huh? what will happen it won't stay on the roof it will slide down it will come down slide down means it will come down so in some places where it is snow is more they will use sloping roofs they will use sloping roofs so that rain water the snow it will slide down next f l a t flat r o o f s roofs flat roofs next is flat roof sloping roof all understood this is sloping roof yes slanting roof next flat roof means this is house children yes roofs will be like this straight now all our roofs are like this only flat yes how is our roof flat comfortable what is the meaning of comfortable at home how you will feel relax comfortable happy yes so all these are new terms children only of we have written some more new terms are there i will give you in the next class now we will read all these new terms okay i explained all the new terms now we will read these new terms okay come on put see the board and you will read with me okay m a t e i a l s materials m a t e i a l s materials you should say children you should read p r o t e c t s protects p r o t e c t s protects t h i e v e s thieves t h i e v e s thieves b r i c k s bricks b r i c k s bricks c e m e n t cement c e m e n t cement p u c c a pakka h o u s e house pakka house p u c c a pakka h o u s e house pakka house v i l l a g e s villages v i l l a g e s e s villages 
M U D mud S T R A W straw M U D mud S T R A W straw mud straw K U T C H A kacha K U T C H A kacha H O U S E house kacha house H O U S E house kacha house P E R M A N D -E N T permanent P E R M A N D -E N T permanent C I T I E S cities C I T I E S cities T O W N S towns T O W N S towns C O T T A G E S cottages C O T T A G E S cottages B U N G A yellow W S bungalows B U N G A L O W bungalow M U L T I multi M U L T I multi S T O R E Y E D storied multi storied building M U L T I multi S T O R E Y E D multi storied means in that building many houses will be there many families will be living together yes like apartment t e m p o r a r y temporary means not permanent t e m p o r a r y temporary c a n v a s canvas c a n v a s canvas s o l d i e r s soldiers who are soldiers one who protect us yes no army people s o l d i e r s soldiers c a r a c a r a v a n caravan c a r a v a n caravan h o u s e house b o a t s boats house boats h o u s e house B O A T S boards, house boards. I G L O O S igloos. I G L O O S igloos. S L O P I N G sloping. S L O P I N G sloping. R O O F S roofs, sloping roofs. F L A T flat. R O O F S roofs, flat roofs. F L A T flat. R O O F S roofs, flat roofs. C O M F O R T A B L E comfortable. C O M F O R T A B L E comfortable. Yes, children understood once again. Materials, protects, thieves. bricks cement pakka house village mud straw kacha house permanent cities towns cottages bungalows multi storied temporary canvas soldiers caravan house boats it glues sloping roofs flat roofs comfortable so now what is your homework you will write lesson 5 my need shelter heading neatly in the four lines and then new terms start with, with all the first letters with capital letter write all the first letters with capital letter how you will write you will divide the paper into two equal parts you will divide the paper into in between you will draw two lines i put numbers in that so two in one paper you divide the paper and write both the sides how you will should write very neatly children yes when you are writing open your mouth spell and write each and every letter very neatly and clearly you should able to read all these words we have read you should able to read all these words if you read all these words then it is easy for you to read the lesson also 
so some more uh, new terms are there we, that we will do it in the next class now today you will write all these new terms very neatly in the classwork and you will read and you will read do your work neatly children read and write thank you children